Many people talk about the problems that have led to Nigeria's underdevelopment, and they list out corruption, bad governance, poor leadership, terrorism, and crime. In my opinion, these things are not Nigeria's biggest problem. They are just mere symptoms of the problem we face in Nigeria. Nigeria's biggest problem is that we are not united. Fix that and you have fixed Nigeria. Today, instead of solving this problem, we have rather chosen to make it worse by poisoning our youth with this unity. Right before our eyes, our youths are using social media to promote this unity and to fight each other on the basis of partisan politics, religion and ethnicity. Nigeria's biggest problem is the reason why it was so easy to colonize our ancestors. We are just never united. For Nigeria to move forward as a nation, we must change our attitude and reasoning. We take such delight in using our considerable intelligence and energy to pull each other down and have none left to pull Nigeria up. The word united in the names of the United States of America, the United Kingdom, and the United Arab Emirates is what made this nation great. They are not smarter than us, they are just more united. Many brilliant Nigerians had their ideas rejected because of where they came from only to go abroad to be successful. This is the case with Chinedu Ocheru and many other Nigerians who are now celebrated abroad. Look at Chief Obafemi Awolowo for instance. Imagine where Nigeria would have been today if only we did not mind where the great man came from and voted him into power. His ideas would have developed Nigeria. It is simply because of disunity that Obafemi Awolowo was the best president we never had. Everyone knew he was the best, but he was rejected because we were and still are so focused on artificial divisions such as tribe and creed. Today, the economy is nosediving, but instead of that being a focus, we prefer to fight while Nigeria burns. If you say the truth about our economy, you are attacked and referred to as an enemy of the present administration. I call on President Mohamed Buhari, the 36 state governors and all ex-presidents to forget their differences and help build unity through their comments and actions. We must stop calling each other derogatory names. If Nigeria see their leaders united irrespective of tribe, religion and party, they will do the same. The only identity God gives you when you are born as Nigerians is Nigerian. All the other identities come after that. There are only two types of Nigerians. There are good Nigerians and there are bad ones. Every other division is artificial. Let us learn to be blind to partisan politics, ethnicity and religion when issues of natural development are concerned. Otherwise, we will never go forward. Instead, we will continue to decline. You can download this entire video for free on my website, benbruce.org. My name is Ben Murray Bruce, and I just want to make common sense.